Hi, my name is Shane. I'm here to talk about some of the features of the Yardmaster Halo system. The Yardmaster Halo system captures all the data from your sensors and pieces of equipment and stores the data indefinitely. With the data capture, you can start seeing patterns and with those patterns, start making more informed management decisions. With the Halo system, you can add and remove modules. A module represents a piece of equipment which we can monitor or control. Depending on uh, who you are, whether you're the manager or the farm worker, you might only want to see certain modules. To do that, all you do is go into your own profile, hit the edit button and go onto the modules. You've got two options, you can add modules or remove modules. So in this case we're going to remove modules because it might be the uh, farm hand and he doesn't want to know all the other details. He, he just wants to start and stop the pump. We go into here. Now we're removing one of the uh, modules, so in this case we're just looking at the uh, pressure gauge. Just tick it and push the remove button and it's removed from your dashboard. We can adjust the configuration, we can adjust the flow rate. So if I go in here and edit this module, I can go down here to this particular point here with the flow rate and I can enter in and adjust the flow rate. And once I've done that, I just save that configuration and is done. The uh, automation now will target that uh, value you've inputted into the configuration. With the system it can do multiple duties. So with this irrigation line here you might be going for seven litres a second but on other side of the farm you only might desire um, six litres a second. So you can, ha you can set up your irrigation line to what flow rate you desire or else you can set it up to the system where it's just driven by pressure, so it will target the pressure. So the VSD will ramp up and down to adjust the pump speed. Also with the Yardmaster Halo system, you can actually input escalation lists. An escalation list can be used for if there's a fault with anything, or whether something's getting turned on or off where on any other parameters, starting a pump, stopping a pump, or if there's a fault, you can actually, you can send it via text message or an email. And so with the escalation list, you can match it up with the chain of command within your farm. Normally what will happen is the actual owner is the last one to actually get the alert. So with the Yardmaster Halo system, you also have six zones available. Each zone can, can be figured independently. So in this case here, we have two dedicated irrigation lines, one set up for seven litres a second, the other zone is set up for eight litres a second. The other two zones actually feeding as flood wash tank. Totally two different duties from the irrigation versus a flood wash tank. And this is where the Yardmaster multi-stage pump comes into play. We're delivering multiple duties with these. We want that pumping as fast as we can to get that tank full. Where the irrigation, we need to have a set flow rate. Within each zone, you can actually set up a schedule um, that's done on the commissioning phase where you push that button to start the irrigator. What will happen, the pump, the stir will start, the valve will open and it will go through that sequence to run the irrigator. That same sequence but on reverse order will be implemented when you stop the irrigator. So what happens, we go into the irrigation zone. This, in this particular case it's actually the cow shed sign. We click onto that module. Within the module, we've got the options to view the configuration. Within this configuration, there's multiple points that can be adjusted because this is all about the control of the pump. So every module is actually receiving data and it's always in the background. And if you desire, you can grab that data in any format. I've already preset some trends up and to do that, it's very simple. You basically go into the trends and you can actually um, create a trend on the spot. I've already set up a trend for the weather station. It comes up with quite a few variables here. And in our case, I've got ambient temperature, rainfall, soil moisture content, and soil temperature. And with the graph, you can drill right down to minutes. And you can actually start seeing trends of how the soil profile or moisture content is changing during through the day. So we also have a module here for bore water. So we can go in and actually look at the daily totals used since the actual meter's been in place. We can download that. 
we can open up the Excel spreadsheet. So here we see the volumes used each day. It gives you the information you need to manage your compliance. For this module, we've got the GPS, and we can click in here and view where the irrigator is. This is used for proof of placement if, if required by council. We can also go through and find the last 15 days where you've irrigated. So this is useful for knowing where you've irrigated and you can start managing your irrigation. So with the Yardmaster Halo effluent system, you also have protection throughout the system. If they go out of the parameters designated by commissioning, they will shut down. With that, that gives you fail safes embedded into the system, i.e. with the irrigator. If the irrigator stops and has not seen a signal saying that it's moving, it will shut the system down. We can also add geofencing protection. If your irrigator intrudes on a no-go zone, it will shut the system down. If you have a high flow, deeming that it's a burst pipe, it will shut the system down. If the pipe gets a blockage, high pressure alert, it will shut the system down. These embedded fail safes can give the farmer peace of mind. So with the Yardmaster Halo system, it's a cloud-based system. You can access it by any smart device, phone, tablet, computer, therefore making it completely portable. Also, we can add milk monitoring within the system. In which it monitors the uh, temperature of the vat. If it comes outside the parameters of the compliance temperature, it will send an alert to the farmer. This is saving you thousands of dollars if you have to dump the vat. If you want a system that's going to be compliant 365 days a year and will aid you in managing your farm, the HALO system is the way to go. If you want more information, please go to the Yardmaster website. My name is Shane, thank you for your time and I look forward to meeting you.